up doll collectors, hobbyists, fabs and besties. I was looking through my doll closet at these adorable little shoes and I thought to myself, I need to expand my collection for real little shoes and I'm gonna need somewhere to store them. So let's make a hidden doll room. I cut a piece of foam board to 13 by 30 inches, scored a line 12 inches from the side on both sides to make a trifold. Cut leftover foam board into three by 11 and a half inch rectangles. I need three per side and two three by four and a half inch rectangles for each side. Then I cut two three by two quarter inch pieces. Once I glue these on, it might be a little too wide for this space. So let's trim these down a little and take them to 11 inches. Then glue the four and a half inch pieces to the sides. Glue one of the two inch pieces in the center. Glue another 11 inch board on top. Uh oh, that's a little tall. No, I should have made these two inches, not two and a quarter. I just trimmed off the top plus the width of another piece of foam board, then glue it in the center, then glue the last piece of foam board on top to make a storage unit. And they should both fit inside the box. Yeah, that'll work. I printed out the walls from our record store and I'm gonna glue them on the top of the walls. I sketch out a design in the center, then go over it with paint. I'm dry brushing on a little rainbow, playing on that Real Littles vibe. Let's glue in our shelves, add floating shelves to the walls to make the perfect place to store our Real Little shoes. We even made it so the boxes can fit on the little shelves. We can stack two on the lower shelves. We can take the shoes out of the boxes and place them on the wall. This can totally be like the most amazing closet ever or be a miniature shoe store. I went to Target and Five Below and bought a few for prices ranging from $4.99 to $5. And I just went online on Walmart's website and they're like three something. So yeah, gotta love a rollback price but I am loving these roller skates. How cute are these? Can Mini Toya fit them? Yeah, they fit pretty good. And I can always split them in the back so they're easy to get on and off. Let's open these things up. We have a lot of shelves to fill. And here's a little shoe box. And inside, oops, we have tape. There we go. Got some tissue paper. Ooh, and some pretty in pink shoes. In the shoe box, there was a collector's guide showing all the shoes and their names and their availability. These shoes easily fit on my classic Barbie and I can balance her to stand. Let's put the shoe box underneath a little tack on the bottom of the shoes, then place them on the wall. I love these little shoe boxes. And our next one is, if I can get the tape off my finger. Ooh, these are called Splash and they are rare. Our Barbies might need some socks to fit these. These are sparkly, they have scales, kind of cute. How do we feel about doubles? I mean, I don't know. If this is a shoe store, then doubles aren't bad. But this is, if this is a closet, then yeah, we don't want doubles. To be honest, I don't want doubles either way. And these are not doubles. Sporty Sport Common Runners. There's definitely a little room in these. I don't need more than one pair of those. I just touched up my nail polish, so I'm trying to be careful when opening these. And you know what? I haven't actually looked over the list to see which shoes I really want. 
And I probably shouldn't because whenever I say I really want a shoe or really want something, I never find it. But I can't help myself. I really want these, the neon glitter. I want unicorn dream. And I think I want these right here, love heart. Did I just mess myself up? Probably, yeah. Wait a minute. <gasps> the rare unicorn dream high tops. Yo, my luck is changing. Oh, but the unicorn's not actually painted gold. It's like a printed shimmer. But the high tops fit great on Barbies, so I still like them. I must confess, I do find tying the little shoes a little tedious. But now we're starting on the ones I got at Five Below, which I think is series two. I could be wrong. How many series are there? One or two? Let me know in the comments. The picture on the box is a little different. So this one has blue and these animal print shoes. And this one has purple and these pretty, pretty colorful rainbow shoes. Inside, oh, look at that. The tissue paper is a different color. It's pink. Oh, did I just mess up my nail? No. Ooh, black shoes. We have a new collector's guide that shows roller skates. And these are called two-tone. They are common. We're gonna need some socks. Looking over this collector's guide, I see a lot of shoes I wouldn't mind having. Like these right here. I think they're called shocks. And these, the interstellar. And ooh, I like rainbow hoops. And of course, the roller skates. But those are ultra rare, so yeah. But you know me, always hopeful. So who knows, this might be the one. Is it, is it? No, casual cool. I don't know, I'm just kind of like meh, cause they're not roller skates. But that's not a good way to act. So we're gonna just keep the energy level going and be excited about whatever we get, regardless if they are roller skates or not. Please be roller skates, please be roller skates, please be roller skates, please. No. Rainbow Ripple, common. Huh, but they fit pretty good. And we have just filled our floating shelves. But that's okay, because we still have space on the top here. For those roller skates. Are these gonna be the roller skates? Uh, I don't think so. Everyone send me some positive vibes. I need those roller skates. Oh my goodness. It worked. I got the disco roller skates. <laughs> yes. Ultra rare heels on wheels. You can't tell me nothing now. Video's over, we're done here. Just joking, we still have like four more to open. But I do love these skates. Now the image on the side is printed, but the wheels actually spin. Very cute. I do still have a few shoes on my wish list, so hopefully we get those too. It would be awesome if we got another set of skates, but we didn't. Common pink camo. And to be honest, I think they're kind of cute. They're a little big on our Barbie. We're gonna need some socks. I am still hopeful that we will get the rainbow hoops or the shocks, because I really want to see those. Ooh, that box is pretty cool. It's a little simpler than the other ones. Is simpler even a word? I don't know. We're not gonna focus on that. All right, and we're gonna open it up. And, oh no, a double. We've done pretty good today at not getting a ton of doubles, so I'm not mad at it. This time, but the next time, who knows? No, I'm gonna be good, I'm just joking. All right, what do we have here? What? Oh, <laughs> I'm being tested, another set of doubles. This is our second pair of Rainbow Ripple sneakers. We're nearing the end and all of a sudden we start getting doubles. What is this? Okay, this is our last one. What do we have here? Oops, the rare golden glitter. Once again, it's a printed effect and then they just brushed it with a glitter. 
I kind of wish it was like a metallic gold paint, but you know, I don't think the dolls will mind. Let's do a shake test. Oh, not too bad. I mean, it did fall off, but it took some effort. And how do you feel about the shoes without the laces? I do think the laces are a fun detail. I just don't like tying them. Am I a lazy doll collector? Maybe. Each one came with a hang tag chain and they have a little RL on them for real littles. Overall, I'm kind of loving real little shoes and our new hidden doll room that we can totally pretend is a doll shoe store. And I did hear that Ken can fit these shoes as well. So let's test that out using one of our doubles. Milo is gonna try the shoes on for us. They look like about the same size as a Ken shoe, but it's definitely snug. I'm making a small cut in the back so they can open and hopefully fit. Oh yeah, look at that. They cut very easily, so <laughs> be careful. Will I be adding to my Real Littles shoe collection? Absolutely. We still have space on the shelves and I'm still looking for those rainbow hoops and shocks. Thank you for joining us while we made a miniature shoe store and filled it with Real Littles shoes. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring the bell and follow us on Instagram at my froggy stuff, the frog vlog, and Bella of My Froggy Stuff. And we will see you next time. Bye!